we're going to have a look at how Hania executes a backhand drop shot from the middle of the court. So sometimes this can be a real tricky territory because that ball's popped out to the middle and you know, the odds are saying that you should win the point from here, but I see a lot of people panic and mess it up. So let's have a look at what she does really well because there is a, is quite a bit going on here that technically it's really, really sound. Okay, so as I said, pretty obvious that the ball pops out to the middle, right? And when the ball's in the middle, when you're taking that ball in short, you have to take almost a slightly more normal swing. You don't really reduce the swing size. Okay, yes, it's definitely more reduced than, say, a lot of power. But if you notice there, she's got her racket up nice and simple, and she has the, the majority of the shape of that backhand normal shot. So it goes from that position one I talk about, round to position two, which is around the shoulder area and maybe around by the ribs. And from there, she gets a lot of cuts on the ball. Okay, I know Sarah Jane's blocking some of the technique here, but we can see most of what she's doing. Also notice when she's in this position, her beautiful body shape, she really just holds her base strong, doesn't panic, and she actually lets the ball drop a little bit into her. So that ball's coming out to the middle, and actually letting it drop in allows her to cut on the inside of the ball. That's a huge thing when that ball's loose in the middle and you've got an angle, is dropping that racket head on the inside of the ball. You'll notice as she does that and drops it on the inside, she's got that bottom edge leading, hasn't she? You see that bottom edge really cuts the ball, so the ball gets some revolutions, comes off the strings nicely, and I really do admire that follow-through. Look at that real purpose, that real extension in that follow-through. If I was being a little bit picky, I might like to see that follow-through go slightly more towards the target, but the fact is that she's got it through and she's released because her swing is not massive in this beginning bit. Yes, as I said, it's almost a normal swing, but there's a lot of shape, a lot of cut, a lot of inside and open racket face, and then with that slightly crouched body position, keeps nice and low, really extends that arm, really sends the ball to where she wants it to go. And again, notice where she finishes with her head and her chest and her shoulders, really purposeful. She's not jumping about, she's not panicking, she's not trying to do anything too special. She's just making sure that this shot is massively secured and placed in that corner. And yes, she has the luxury of the angle, so she can go for that front wall, side wall, going for the nick, and she just catches above the nick there. But her opponent is so out of position that, you know, her not quite rolling it, you know, Sarah Jane's not going to get that. And then the final thing to consider, I've just mentioned it briefly in passing, the way she lets the ball come to her, she lets it drop a little bit in this position. She doesn't try to rush and go onto it. And what that does, it just holds Sarah Jane in that position. Okay, Sarah Jane does a really nice split step, but look at how she's pretty much blocked in behind her opponent. Not much you can do from that position. If Hania was going to take that ball slightly earlier, there might be an opportunity for Sarah Jane to go around either side of her, maybe left, maybe right. But because she just lets it come into her, there's a lot of advantages about letting that ball come to you. Okay, I'm a big fan of taking that ball early, but in the right context, in the right time, that ball's shooting out to the middle, that angle's only getting better for Hania. It's pushing Sarah Jane further back. Tactically, to just wait on that one, sink her knees, open that racket face, beautiful follow through. All of that now contributing to the effectiveness and the quality of this shot.